The Two Wolves Once upon a time, there lived a Native American chief. The old chief was a wise man who had lived a long and enlightened life. He had seen wars and peace, love and hate, joy and sorrow. Now, in his twilight years, he had decided to share his wisdom with his grandson. He wanted to teach the young boy about the essence of life and how to live it well. One day, as the two sat under the shade of a large tree, the old man began to speak. There is a fight going on inside me, he said as he looked at his grandson. A fight between two wolves. The young boy was intrigued. What kind of fight, grandfather? The old man looked into his grandson's eyes. Within each of us, there exists two wolves. One has only negative traits like spitefulness, anger, and greed while the other embodies positive qualities such as tranquility, affection, and happiness. The young boy listened intently, as he tried to grasp the meaning of his grandfather's words. He asked him which wolf is winning. The old man looked to the ground and sighed. It is a constant battle, the grandfather said. This same fight is going on inside you, and everyone else on the face of the earth. Both wolves are hungry. The question is, which wolf will you feed? The young boy pondered this revelation for a moment, before asking, How do I know which wolf to feed? The old man smiled. It is very simple. Feed the wolf that you want to win. If you want to be kind, feed the good wolf. If you want to be angry, feed the bad wolf. It's your choice, and your choice alone. The young boy nodded, understanding his grandfather's words. From that day on, he tried to feed the good wolf as much as possible. He was kind to his friends and family, he helped those in need, and he tried to be humble in all his actions. As the years went by, the young boy grew up to be a wise and compassionate man, just like his grandfather before him. He passed on the old man's wisdom to his own children and grandchildren, teaching them the importance of feeding the right wolf. And so, the legacy of the old chief lived on, through the teachings he had passed down to his grandson, and through the lives of all those who had been touched by his wisdom. As long as people remembered the importance of feeding the right wolf, there would always be hope, for a better more peaceful world. If you like inspiring stories like this, please like and subscribe.